From the goal 11, and welcome to today's fourth episode of my Everton career mode. Previously, in my last video, we got two wins and two matches, and today is a big day. We are facing Manchester City. We still, we still are in the transfer market, as you know. We got um, Marquinhos, uh, Alessandrini, Castillo, and. Jesse starts from LA Galaxy for for a second forward, and we're still look we're still looking for a semi defensive middle, so we're we're still looking for that. But hey, let's get started with this match, guys. As you can see, Lukaku is the top scorer for right now, three goals in two matches. But let's get started with this match for City. It's a big game. It's a big game for us. And like I said, we need to improve. We need to win those these type of games against these type of big clubs. We need to. Take that step and become a better club, be more competition, be more more competitive against big clubs like this. Alright, so let's just start. We're actually, usually, we always wear the blue jersey, so it's their time to change the kit into the dark blue jersey. Everything's usually much better, obviously. Everything, and this is a big match. This is a, I'm really nervous for this match. I just hope our boys do good and we get the win, guys. Right, so let's get started, guys. Let's get started. Let's go, Everton. All right, guys. Everton against Manchester City. We're home at Goodison Park, so that's good. We we have to get the win. I don't want no tie. I don't want no loss. I want the win. I don't care if it's 1-0. I don't care if it's 2-1. I don't care if it's 3-0. I just want the win. We really need this win against these type of clubs, especially Manchester City. I I, I think we could give them a, a good good game. We could play head to head against them. And well, let's get started with this game, guys. For our first half, and let's get this game started, guys. Let's, get, let's try and get Lukaku two goals today. All right, guys, let's win these setters. Let's win these setters. Let's win these setters. Oh, Miralas, Miralas, with a fucking terrible mistake of Joe Hart. With a terrible mistake of Joe Hart. Miralas was right there. He conquered the opportunity. Okay, Bonnie. Okay. Oh my God, and Kevin De Bruyne strikes it in. 1-1, one, one. I don't know. Nice. Oh my god. Barkley! Barkley! What a beautiful play! What a pass by Lukaku! He passes it to Barkley. He was he saw him all alone and there it is. One Nice. So it's first half, 2-1. We it's a pretty even match. Both sides been attacking a lot. We managed to score two goals. So we're up 2-1. And well I have no idea why they aren't playing Aguero. I don't know why they why they aren't playing with their main squad. Um, this this one thing I, I I don't know like why FIFA does this, but they don't play with their stars like Aguero and like Hart. Like I I don't get that. But let's get straight to the second half. All right, second half. Let's keep this let's keep the score like this, or let's try to augmentate this score let's try and get more goals let's do this boys let's get that ball nice miralas lukaku 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 is there to finish it boys lukaku is there to finish it lukaku with a 3-1 he uses all his power all his strength and he took the defender and he nets it in on the back of the net. 3-1. It seems like an Everton win. Everton is about to take the win. 3-1, boys. And there it is, guys. That's the end of the game. We ended up winning 3-1. What a perfectly amazing performance by the team. Perfect performance by Lukaku. He never gave up. He got his goal. And Everton takes this game. Everton 3. Manchester City 1. And our next match is against Oxford United on Capital One Cup. You know what? I'm gonna give the youth 
our youth players some opportunity, see what they they could give me, see what they have, and I mean, let's see who we could get here. Okay, so Lukaku is going out. Jesse Sarge is going in. Jailer Fu is going in. And that's left middle. Castillo is going in. Barry is gonna have to go off for Bezik. And I'm putting Ledzen for McCarthy. Marquinhos going out for Hines Mori. And I'm putting Browning for Jagielka. Bain is going out for Galloway. And even though he's old, Hilbert, and I'm trying to sell him, I'm putting him in. And Harry is going in for Robles. So there it is. I changed my whole squad. Oh, and Barkley needs to go out for. Barkley, 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 for, for, for Naismith, Naismith, he deserves it. Okay, so I changed my whole squad, guys, see how it goes. Hopefully these youth um, players give me, give me some good, some good things, show me some good things so they could be, um, look forward to being the first team. So let's get this, this match started, guys. Alright, so this is the first game of the Capital One game. For us, Everton against Oxford United, it's Goodison Park. It's raining. That that makes it more dramatic and more intense. So let's see what these lads have. Let's see what these lads have for us, for me as a coach. Let's see. Bessage, oh, what a beautiful goal right in the corner by Bessage. I was not expecting that. I was expecting to for it to go out or the goalie was blocking it. But no, it went in. What a Jesse Sarge for his first goal for Everton. Jesse! Jesse Sarge! And it's his first goal for the team. At least it's in the cup. It's 2-0. And Jesse Sarge scored. Take a shot, Bessage. Take a shot! What a beautiful shot! Bessage once again with a long shot. And that was an amazing sh first half, guys. We've been dominated the whole game. They only took one or two shots on us. We've taken three shots, and we're winning 3-0. And that's that's the way I want to see my team working. See, I see great stuff with this. So let's get started with the second half. Nice by Naismith. Nice by Naismith. Nice by Naismith. Naismith! Naismith! And it goes in! What a weak shot, but it still goes in. It went through the keeper's hands. I I don't I can't explain myself. How does that go? How does that happen to you, goalkeeper? And yes, it's clearly a goal. It's clearly a goal. 4-0, Naismith. And there it is guys, 4-0, we ended up winning the game, 4-0, we ended up conquering the game, we dominated the game except the last few minutes, I let, I let them have the ball, they, could, they didn't attack us, they were just playing the ball, they couldn't go on, on our side of the field, I see great things, I saw great things for, from these lads, I have my eye on some of them, and I'm, I am gonna, going to be including them in the first team, in the next matches, so 5 shots, 5 shots on target, and 100% shot accuracy. All right, guys. So we're still waiting for Igorin's answer. If he doesn't answer and if he doesn't accept our our bid on him, then we're gonna have to go with Ibora because we really need a center defensive midfielder, and we we actually need a left back as well or a right back. But I think I'm just gonna wait for that for the winter transfer window. But here is an important game against Tottenham. We are going to have to go and play this match, guys. It's Tottenham. We're playing away. It's a big club. And we're finally playing against... We're fin finally playing away against a big club. That's Tottenham. We need to get the win. Tottenham is one of the top top five teams in the BPL. And, well, we really need to get this win. We're playing with our main squad, with our starting 11. And let's hope we get this win and let's hope for Everton, let's hope we get this win. If we do, we're gonna have a perfect, perfect, 
perfect, perfect, perfect record. I mean, perfect. We're gonna have five wins, five games, five wins, and I mean, this this will be awesome. So let's get straight to the game, guys. All right, Tottenham Hotspurs, Tottenham Hotspurs. I mean, against Everton, White Hart Lane. The fourth game of the season. It's raining. It's gonna be a dramatic game, more intense, like always in the rain game. Well, let's see what we're made of. Let's see if this Everton team is actually made of something. Let's see if we're actually a big club, if we're improving, if we're going on top, if we're giving that next step. Let's, let's prove that in this game. Oh, come on, Ref. Ref. Oh, you messed up the play, Ref. Wow. Oh, no. Oh no. Oh no, that was the ref's fault. Tottenham is up 1-0 guys. That was clearly the ref's fault. That was clearly the ref's fault. Come on, you cannot oh come on. So 1-0. Come on Everton. Nothing happened. We're still 0-0. I'm having a good game. And there it is guys. 1-0. That was Actually, it has to be 0-0. Zero, zero. That was the ref's fault. It all started from what, from the ref. It, I, was, I had made a pass and then hit the ref. Tottenham recovered the ball. They passed and passed and passed and they scored. So that was really early in the game. Six minutes. We're losing 1-0. We're going to have to make a change probably. We're going to have to take out Alessandrini. And we're going to have to put in Lennon. And I mean, let's see what let's see what Lennon brings us. Let's see what Lennon brings us. Oh my God! No, ref! How is that a penalty? No, no! I want to see the replay. How he got the ball? He got the ball. Oh come on, Howard! Come on, Howard! Come on, Howard! Come on, Howard. You got this, you got this. Oh, for fuck's sake. It's 2 0. Everything's up. Things are getting difficult here. Things seem very hard now. Alright, let's get this. Let's get this up. Come on, Barkley. Lukaku. Lukaku puts it in. Come on, Lukaku. And that was a beautiful play by Barkley. He swifted off. He brought all the defenders against him. He they left Lukaku alone, and Lukaku nets it in. When you give Lukaku a chance, just one chance, he's gonna put it on the back of the net. And there you go. That's the result. Two one. Lukaku. Barkley. 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 Barkley had the chance. Barkley had the chance. Oh my god. Oh, I hit the bar. And that's it, guys. Our first loss of the season against Tottenham. We still can't make that next step. We still can't make that next step and beat the big big clubs. We lost 2-1 against against Tottenham and we beat Manchester City 3-0. How, how is that? How is how is that? So, yeah, there you go, guys. First loss of the season. It was an even match. And we lost our first game of this. All right, guys. So after trying to get Fellaini, after trying to get Schneiderlin, after trying to get so many center defensive midfielders, after trying to get um, who else was I trying to get? Um, Ibora. After trying to get um, Guarín, they all rejected me because they said, "Oh, I can't accept your your request because I'm a top player for my team, or because I cannot change." Cold, um, culture or or whatever but we finally get a semi defensive middle it's R Ramirez from Chelsea yes I took I took Ramirez away from Chelsea he's pretty young still he's at a good age he's 28 so we are going to accept the offer and he's gonna be our player for the rest of the, for the next two years and we got Marquinhos as a goal, uh, as a goal, we got Marquinhos. That's like one of our big signs this year, and we finally got our center defensive middle, which is 
which is Ramirez. And I feel great things. Ramirez is going to fit in perfectly with this team. And well, that concludes on today's episode, today's fourth episode of my career mode with everything, guys. I, ho I hope you enjoyed it. I hope you liked it. If you did, make sure to give that thumbs up. Make sure to leave that, leave a like. Make sure to leave a comment. And if you're new to the channel, make sure to subscribe to the channel you won't regret it trust me and well that concludes this episode i hope you guys enjoyed make sure to give like i said make sure to leave that thumbs up make sure to leave a like so if you want me to keep on going with this career mode if you want new stuff if you want more stuff like this leave a like and well that's it for today you guys remember a ball is all i need in my feet it's not just a sport it's a feeling and I'll catch you guys later, Cappy Nation. Peace out.